This video is sponsored by Value Testers. Great promo offer on Testo, Field Piece, and Baccarat. Free two day shipping on purchase of $200 or more on selected seasonal testing equipment. Link in description below. Morning, guys, June 7th, 2019. This one here, I gotta go change an outside faucet. She's got a couple of them over there, a little crusty. I think she's got more outside faucets at this house. And I have replaced one that I know of. I was there the other day. A couple of them, the handles are kind of kind of rough shape. So I'm gonna go swap out the bad ones, the ones that, that are looking a little crusty. She's got like she's got like shrubs and gardens over this whole area, so they need those they need those faucets to water. Uh, I know one for sure. That one for sure. I gotta change out the handle. It's a uh, handle's all cracked on it. four or five of those frost free ones in the truck so I'll change out the ones that are bad ones that look crusty we'll change them try to get you some shots all right guys this one seems fine I'm not changing it unless it needs to be changed. This one I replaced last year. This one's fine. This one's fine. I had to turn it on in the cellar and put a little cap on it. I didn't have the cap on to shut off. Same thing with this one. I had to tighten up the, the bleeder cap downstairs. I did install this heat pump a while back. Oh, that one just needs a flipping gasket. I'm telling you, can't make this shit up. Probably just needs a flipping gasket in there or something. It's loose. Gasket, I don't think, but maybe that's all it was needed to be tightened. Can't make this shit up, guy. What's wrong with that thing? That'll have to come off come winter time. Well, this thing will definitely freeze. We'll go downstairs and make sure we got no floods down there, but this one's fine. Yeah, make this shit up, mama. There's one in the back here that's got to be changed for sure. Cause I was here last, I was here the other day and looking at them. <clears throat> I did go down in the basement and shut it off down there already. I might even have another handle for this, but I don't know if I could even get it apart. I probably got another handle for it. I don't know if that nut will come off. If it does, we'll try changing just the handle. No, I can't even get the nut off of there, so we'll have to replace this one. No big deal. Down in the crawl, well, it's not really a crawl space. I'm standing up in here, but it's not a, uh, not a full cellar. I can stand up in here, and it's a... Uh, She's got four of these, and this is the only one that really needs to be replaced. So, I'm only going to replace the one that needs it. And, uh, I did clean the pipe before I cut it. We'll get a jet coupling in there.
All right, so I've got the other one pulled out here. And uh, we'll, we'll take the new one, we'll solder it on here. And then we'll measure it, we'll make a cut. We'll slide it in. I'm gonna lead a coupling for inside. So it won't build up pressure. And uh, last thing we'll do is we'll screw it in. Some new screws. I just open these up and I just solder that. I don't take them apart. Never had a problem with it. I'd rather, I'd rather solder these than try to uh, put a female adapter on here. Some guys will take them apart. I never have an issue. Just solder it up quickly and it'll be good. If you're not really good at Sodom, and I guess if you take it apart, you'd stop cooking it. It's fine, that ain't gonna be an issue. I came in here, I fitted this in, I just have to go outside, screw it in, level it off, and then solder this end. Oh, I got a couple of screws in it. We can shut this because we got the uh, bleeder inside, right? This should be fine. I just gotta go in and solder the inside and put that cap on, it'll be done. fogged out, a little smoked out, but I had to clean the lens. That little bleeder, I mean it's good to put them in there so it don't build up pressure. I'm a little dingy down here. Upside down valve. She's a laker. She's a pisser. I just gotta tighten them up a little bit more. She's a laker, mama. She's a laker. There we go. There's a little gasket in there. The gasket ever goes bad, just put some put some Teflon, roll some Teflon tape up and use that as a gasket. It'll work fine. Just gonna put this insulation back and we're good to go. She's a leaka, mama. She's a leaka. Yeah, that's fine. It's good to check things, make sure you have no leaks. Uh, that's not dripping. I have changed this. I have changed this sub pump here in the past. I put a couple of. It's always good to check, make sure that it's working. I did change a couple of heat pumps for this lady. No systems in here. She's got some old, old water tanks. I've got the high tide level when it floods. Oil fired water heater. That thing's getting a little. 
she's getting a little crusty. Been a couple of years since the since the service on that too. I have to talk to her about that. Been in three years. While I'm down here, I changed the filters. I got a couple of systems down here. I'll check them. I got extra filters I left. So, I'll put them in as we go. I'll hook a hose up to it, make sure it's good before I go. Should be able to put them on by hand. Good thing, girl, like a snake. Oh, that's fine. Alright guys, this other one, I got no washer in it, that's why I had to tighten it up, we'll put a washer in it and we'll try it again, I like these red ones, you should be able to put that on by hand, take it off by hand, you know what's going to happen come, come fall, if it's on with pliers, <clears throat> you know it ain't going to ever come off, right, it'll be a freeze up. Let's see if that works better there. I did locate another one in the front yard. There's no sense in changing them unless they need it, right? Crave cave crickets down there. It might bite me. Five outside faucets. I mean, that's a lot. I mean, this place is like a like a Japanese garden over here. There's stuff everywhere. Another one in the front here that I did check, and it's fine. So they're all on. All five of them are on. Hello, Miss Molly. You miss me? Oh, I know. Yeah, you miss me. I know you miss me. Yeah, you love Daddy. Oh, I know you love Daddy. Yeah. Well, you got your you got your uh, little Chewbacca feet all trimmed there yesterday. Oh yeah, the Chewbacca feet's all trimmed up. Let's take a look at them. You, you look like a little regular dog. Yeah, you do. No more Chewbacca feet. I thought you don't bark. Oh, what do you want? You want pets? Oh, I know you want them. Yeah, you want kisses. Yeah, you want kisses. I know you do. All right, let me just pick this stuff up and clean my hands up. So out of five outside faucets, there was one that needed to be replaced. The other ones are still working fine, so I'll we'll leave them. I mean, it's a little bit of a job to change them all. She wants to change them all if they're bad. I mean, I'll change the ones that are bad as they go bad. I got other things to do than just waste my time changing stuff. I don't change things unless it needs to be changed. You can spend the money on a gardener. To Usually always a bunch of people over there working, digging digging weeds and raking the beds and always someone over there. 